I'm a marketing rebel, a marketing rebel. Nate Kennedy here with another video. Old marketing strategies don't die. Let me explain. So when people get into marketing for their business, they often turn to the newest marketing trend and ignore some of the older techniques that have been around tried and true. But it's important to try some of those older marketing trends, especially when everyone is following the same set of rules. So when everybody was off Google, this years ago, I'm aging myself because they were shutting people down. I was leveraging Google ads and making it work by playing by their rules, right? So I continued to use some older methods and I mastered every one of them along the way. Now, while people were trying to shift to the new shiny platforms, we stuck to the basics. If you have a solid grip on the basics, you move quickly when industry shift. So for example, back in 2011, we started a company called Funnel Architects. This was before the funnel industry had even taken off. Next thing you know, everyone is a funnel builder. So we became funnel a funnel optimization company. You gotta stay a step ahead of the curve. So competition will continue to grow. There are even some imposters that are gonna pop up, creating a massive red ocean in front of you. So for example, the complicated funnels that we built back in 2011, became the thing to be to do by 2014 and they continue to be a thing now so it's no longer a trend it's around but it's also why we launched the one-step funnel it's simple and it works so more importantly it's the fastest way to give a passionate crowd of people the things they love we started refocusing on our one-step funnel model easier to use not as complicated the above may seem slightly off topic i get it right i'm kind of talking about marketing pieces, but the point that I'm trying to make is you gotta be the trend setter and not the trend follower. So stay, ahead, stay a step ahead of the curve and know that you will often need to go back to the basics. So trends and shiny objects will always emerge, but the basics will keep your business running. Another example is when people focus entirely on new trends, they forget to build the audience, which is the smartest way to control growth and fight against rising costs on ad, ne ad networks. And the best way to build an engaged audience is with email list in our newsletter process, which is what we spend our time focused on. Now, this goes back to the idea of marketing smarter, not harder. Revenue doesn't become tight if you own your own audience. So in a Facebook or Google shut your ad account down one day, you still have an audience to access so you're not as worried about it. Most most people don't think this way and rely solely on other people's audience to generate the revenue for their business. And marketing is the backbone to any business. And if you own your audience, you will always have people seeing your business. Hey, if you gain value from this video, do me a favor, like, comment, share, and help us get this message out. Thank you.